All right, it's Sunday. We're getting ready for tomorrow. But before we keep going, I want to show you guys, not these kids, because they're not doing any work. I want to show you guys some of these stingrays that came in on this unboxing that we're going to give it to you guys. The rays are doing pretty good. They're all saddled. Let me see here. Oh, uh, those are the nice ones. And then you have all these albinos. You have albino pearls. And these are the pink ones. They're so weird looking. That one is a really nice one. That's the cinnamon looking one. And you have a whole selection of them. And I hope you enjoyed. If you have any questions on the Stingrays, we should have them up on the website this week. Enjoy the video. Hey guys, welcome back to Predatory Fins. Today is going to be the last shipment of the week. The week. It's Saturday. So next week there's more. <laughs> well, okay, yeah. Sunday, we got a day off tomorrow. Yes. And then we actually have to go to LA, right? Pretty soon? Pretty soon. Uh, we're just waiting for all these shipments to come in. Maybe even next week. So if you're in LA and you want to see Feijia and I, Feijia and I, Feijia and I, mm -hmm. let us know. We'll, uh, we should do a meet and greet of that because we're probably not going to go back there in a long time. Probably. Right? Yeah. But it depends if we have the time though. We're there for, for business as well. For business. If you have some business for us to do, let us know. But today, this shipment here came from Asia and it's a lot of uh, cool stuff. I don't know everything that comes in because he, well, these kids, man, I don't understand. Hanging on by a thread over here. You girls used to speak like They're talkers like you. That's what it is. That's it's true. just they're not formulating their words yet. So. I, I do that sometimes. <laughs> I don't formulate them either. But right here, we're going to start with stingrays. Yes. These came in, and I'm looking at the quality. Albino pearls. Good size. They look like about like almost six and a half to seven inches. Yeah. Maybe, maybe range. Some are bigger, some are smaller. So this shipment here is going to be a mixture between stingrays and some fish. Yes. Yes. Okay. I mean, look, we got 20 boxes. We got 20 boxes of fish to go over. So what we're going to do right now, we're going to put the stingrays here, take a look at them, see the quality. If it's not, if it's not AAA quality, then we don't want it at all. How's oh, that? No, and I'm part of it too. Okay. <laughs> Our tank of albino pearls, they're acclimating right now. And sometimes people ask like, oh, why you have so many in a tank? It's just, this is just acclimation. Once we finish acclimating them, as you can see, the water is pretty dirty. So what's happening right now, look, clean, fresh water, coming through here, moving around, and all the older water is getting drained out that way. And then once the temperature warms up a little bit, what we do is we just open this up, remove a lot of their water, and start fresh. But in the same box, we had two stingrays that look really insane. Look at this one. Oh, it's like opposite. Right? Super pretty, crazy spots. Let me see, let me see, let me see. What is this, Vijay? Well, quality gray, wow. but you give that. Holy cow. And then this is different I don't know too. which one I like better. Yeah, this is a golden base. You can see it right away. It's much oh, more bright yellow. Sarah. Sarah wants this one. Okay, and it's got the, the golden eyes. Ooh. This guy over here, this is probably a red variant. You see the eyes are a little bit darker, like a cinnamon color. But I like the pattern. It looks like all donuts. Right. You see that? Yeah. Every single spot is a donut. Really cool. So is that a keeper, breeder? What is that? Oh, man. <laughs> Sarah, I got you right here. <laughs> Wait, 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 I didn't decide if I wanted it yet. You we, promised, we promised her, her that we're going to get we a yellow more. base. We got, oh, we got we more. more, we got we more, we got more. <laughs> ah, those are dope. Not happening. Do people say dope still? Is that still a thing? I just said the it. The new generation? I just said it. I'm old generation. Right here, we have, is this the red or the golden? These are the red, the red machines. The red machines. We had the last shipment and people loved it sold out quick so we brought more these guys get huge right yes they do what's the scientific name do you know i don't know oh, Pichai, i thought you I said you, you know everything I, I can learn really quickly though okay so and, next video i'll tell you what it is and in here we have a very special catfish that i think a lot of catfish lovers are gonna love it <laughs> love it lovers so right here this little guy right let me get him right here by the water by the light so this is a leopard 
catfish. It's a it's a hybrid of a rip saw. We had them before in a bigger size, and now we're able to get little ones. Black spots like a leopard pattern throughout the whole body, and they're a little bit transparent as well, so you kind of get like a purplish hue on the base of the body, so it's really nice. Rod, why don't you show them a picture of what a bigger one looks like on the screen? We need to start acclimating because they look a little weak, so let's go ahead and start acclimating them. Yeah, they're still little guys. But, you know, at least this time they're not gonna be for a lot of money. These are gonna be a lot cheaper. Yeah, because in the past, they, they were they were only like available at this size, and with freight and the nature of the fish, it ended up being, you know, quite an expensive fish around like high $200 range. But now this is gonna be much more affordable at this size, because a lot of people wanted them back then, but it's like, oh man, I don't want to spend so much money. So now we got you smaller ones, so don't miss out. Right there you can see their leopard rip saw. Really cool fish, they eat pellets, but they also eat shrimp and cut fish, but they can grow in pellets as well, no problem. Look, it's a little bit bigger one here. It's mm -hmm. gonna be easier to see. And they're not aggressive towards each other. Like a lot of catfish, they, they won't like eat each other. Really cool fish. I definitely gotta keep some of these guys to grow out for the exhibit, but right now, let's go into another box. I'll show you guys when the water's crystal clear, then you can see it really well. These, I think Fage, I ordered them. They're shore body albino barbs. Is that what it is? Yeah. Tim foil albino, wow. They're really shore body. This box, ooh, these look nice. What are these? Sleeper gobies? Yeah, the marble, marble sleeper gobies. Good size on them. Okay. Good color. I so, didn't know they had red on them. You see that, that pinkish red on their tail? Yeah. I always thought they were just like a brownish fish. All right, let's see what these guys look like. Super cool fish. They just stay on the bottom and they attack the fish. You know, they're great from the bottom. But nice. I like the markings. They, they, I think these are called the Kobutai. Kobutai? Kobutai. Kobutai. Okay. Kobutai Botias. They're black with like really striking yellow markings, like lines, dots, dashes all over the place. Yeah, that, that big one you can see a little bit better. Like Morse code? Yeah. It'll look better in the tank. It's hard to see. All right, let's get it in the tank. Ooh. Hey, Jai, these yeah. sold really well last time. I know. <laughs> yeah, we got them again. How do they look? Wow. They look really nice. These are the pinstripe Dumbo? No, the spotted Dumbo. Oh, sorry, sorry. Yes. Spotted Dumbo. They turn out to be really pretty fish, right? Mm-hmm. All right, you want to show or not even bother? Yeah, show it, show it. Yeah, here we go. It almost looks like a saltwater fish. Yeah, like a tang. Yeah. Like mm -hmm. a saltwater tang. You gotta wake up, bro. Stop what? thinking about food. I'm hoping you're talking to Luke. These look cool, where are they? <laughs> These are the blue machiers. Small blue machiers. What do, you, what do you think they are? Like two inches? Two, two and a half, right? Two, two and a half, yeah. They look almost golden at this this size. Well, the gold machine, oh, the blue machine does have a gold sheen to them. And then the blue is more in the base color of the fish. Okay. And then the, the, the metallic shine is kind of like a gold. So these so are the blue tie machine. Yes. All right. Smaller size, so you guys get a lot cheaper than the, the usually size we get. The, What's that song? <laughs> you can actually do that song. How did how does he do it? Like this? Move the belly. I was gonna cut this off, now I'll leave it. Hey, he pretty buck, come on, give me that. Let's go. Oh, you said let's go. We're too slow that he complains. Well, he learned from yesterday. I know, right? Yeah. All right, so we have to make some tank space to start acclimating all the fish. But look how nice these guys are. Super cool, short body, albino tinfoil barb. And every single one of them is super round. Guys, we're a little bit tired because we had a long, long week. But it's guys' birthday week. Yeah, happy birthday, by the way. Yeah, that drinking last night killed me. He drink water. <laughs> yeah, a little sip of wine. What a, it's okay, it's okay. We, he knew we had to work hard today. But after everything, we open this box, and it's just like, it just blows in your face. Blows in your face. No, Look at it. it glows in my face, but it blows <laughs> in your face. Oh, the machines. But yeah, well, look, show them. It's this just is like iridescent. It's, Blowing. Yeah, it's blowing, not blowing, sorry. Look how pink 
Wow. Let's see. Let's see. Ooh. You can see through the bags how pink they are. What are these, Fajai? Pink panther rays? <laughs> Phantom rays? They're, they're hybrids. Look, babe. That's all I can say. Super pink. Yeah. It's supposed to be the golden base, but I don't know why they're so pink. It's crazy. You've seen it's, pink rays like that before? Well, it depends on what they use to hybridize it with. It might have been a type of ray that had more orange base. Look at the eyes on that one. You can barely see the eyes. Yeah. Nice. So this is a high-end race. Huh, KJ? One more better than the next. Oh, yeah. All right, so there's five in this bag. We're going to start acclimating them. Ooh, look at this one. It's hard to pick, like, the favorite one, but the eyes on these are crazy. Wow. But I, I, if you put a black light on these things, mm -hmm. it'd be insane. Let's take a look at it in the tank. Yeah, show them this one. Look so pink? I think it's the type of ray they hybridize it with. You know how like Matoros have like an orange spot to them? Uh -huh. So this is probably some type of Matoro albino hybrid with like a mantilla ray that also has like an orangey type of color. And now you're starting to get all these crazy colors. It's amazing. There's more here. Check this out guys, check this, this out. One. This is crazy. So this is more of orange. Yes. But it could be, like you said, the, it was the yellow medicine. Because this one wow. doesn't have the medicine. That's Look at the spots. Nice. Now, there's one here that looks really crazy. Ooh, yeah. It's huge. Look at the markings. Mm -hmm. It's wow. just like patterns. Like, well, you see, guys, this is why I've always liked hybrid stingrays. Because every single one is unique. No right. one can have the same one. And, and it just makes it all the more fun. Just like our kids, babe. Mm -hmm. Unique. <laughs> every single one. Look at that. Oh, wait, 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 look. Yeah. Boobies. Oh my god. Or it's right. like a or face, like a nose and a mouth and a uh, bottle. Right? What about this? This thing gray is going to be uh, for sale. Wow. That's Ooh, nice. Oh, I like that one too. Yeah, look at that. This, this is the cinnamon version mm. or the mm. red version. Cinnamon. Cinnamon red. All right, just wait, wait, don't go away. There's oh, one more. There's one more. one. Look at that. Little one. All so, right, so, so we're going to have to take the individual pictures because some people are like, I like the exact mm -hmm. boobies one. You it's know. a lot of work to take photos. I'll try. I'll Listen, try. if I was going to buy something online, I want to know exactly what I'm okay. buying. So we're going to do that for you guys. He's going to do that. He's going to do it. Yeah. Okay. See you next box. It'll never get done. <laughs> Whoa. That That's is a nice, nice little twirl. And they put the... The straw. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's, they, didn't, they, didn't, they chose not to cut the stinger on them, so they put a protective... Uh, tubing over it so it won't puncture the bag during shipping. They look like the mirror images of each other. Like some are white with the, the pink in the middle and mm -hmm. then it's like pink with the white around. Yeah. So you can see the difference, right? That This is mm -hmm. the cinnamon red one. I can't believe it. They barely fit the bag. Look at that. Oh my gosh, it looks like it's this black bottom bag. <laughs> I know, look, the tail's wrapped around yeah. the bag. All so right. we got to figure out the what these are. I know what these are. What is it? These are hybrid rays, designer rays, like with really crazy cool patterns. So let's see if they lived up to uh, the standard. These are pearls. Oh, these, these are, are pearls. pearls. <laughs> okay, roll box. That's a big pearl. It's a big, big pearl. though, yeah. yeah. You can even see it. Can you yeah, see it? A little bit. Yeah, yeah, it's dark, but it's cool. All right, so yeah. rewind that yeah. for the next box, what I said, okay? These are pearls. I didn't expect them to be this big. They told me they were big, but I expected like eight, nine inches. But this is probably more like 10, 11, maybe even 12 on a, a, a so, few pieces. So how long do you take for these guys to start breeding? I don't think it'll take much longer for them to breed, really. I mean, nowadays with captive bred rays, they breed at a much younger age. So the question is, are these, they look like mostly females at the moment. So I think uh, probably another couple of months of just conditioning, get them fat and healthy, they should be able to breathe. I've seen so many white rays, and then you come around and you come ah, crazy pearls, super dark. This box right here has some really, really good goodies that my, my people are gonna some want. Some what? Goodies. Goodies? Did I say it wrong? Yes. How do you say it? Goodie. How do you say it, Vajay? Say what? Goodies. 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 That's Not what I said. Goodies. I said goodies. goodies. Yeah. Yes. Look at this. These, Let's start with this one. These goodies <laughs> are gonna be for the exhibit. At least one or two of them. Wow. It's like a tiger. Yeah. Yeah. So 
this is kind of what I was saying uh, with the mantilla. They have like a weird maze-like pattern. And you can kind of see it in some of the other albino rays too. But yeah, these were selected out. All right, we only so, got a few pieces of these. So quick question, if you had to pick one, buy one out of this box, which mm -hmm. one would be? This one. Why? I just like the pattern. The pattern and the color. I think I agree I with that. Really, I think I'll go with this, this one. one. Yeah, that one's good too. It would be between these two for me. Yeah? Because you like the lighter, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah, but don't worry, there's more. There's another box. <laughs> so we're gonna pick again. I have a good eye, right? See? Mm -hmm. so as we put them all in, the one that's gonna pop is that one. So are these for sale or no? Yes, they're for sale. I, but I will be keeping probably like two. Three, four. <laughs> Three, four. I like the difference, like the darker one here and then the versus the lighter one there. They look nice together. Alright. Another guy's covered already. The two, but see, that's the one that pops. Yep. That's normal? Yeah, I love it. Yeah. Oh, okay, I remember this guy. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's see what's in here, what's in here. Ooh, that's I like cool. the bright spots. Yeah. Yeah, so these two are spotted. And those other ones are more like mosaic pattern. I don't think I've ever seen black pearls before. All the pearls that we see are more like round. But this is like, you have a lot of black on this. This is natural or? or is well, as, as they get older, they get darker as well. A lot of rays do that. Oh. Same thing like black diamonds. So you're used to seeing a lot more of the younger yeah. pups, okay. right? So it's normal for a darker. Yeah, so, so but you see the, the, the gold ring? Once we get it into a tank and settled in, that part will brighten up again. But now you get more of the black and gold contrast. End of the video, we're just gonna show you guys all the stingrays that acclimated. We already put some vinyl pearls away, right? Yes, we have so, to make room for more. Look how pretty they are now. This one right here is that cinnamon one, right? That you're yep. talking about. Super cool, there's a yellow one there that might be sold. Down below we have the pearl and the hybrid. Spotted, right? Hybrid, right? Yep. And then we have, these I don't even know. You, you know. Oh, okay. Color hybrids, I would say. Sorry, thank you. Or designer you. hybrids. <laughs> so we got a couple of them over there. And then up here, we have the hybrid catfish. We put some blood worms. A lot of them started eating already. They came in a little skinny, so we're going to feed them well. And I noticed there's a couple of short bodies in there too. Okay, and then the bigger pearls here. Yeah, these are young adults near maturity. So anyone who wants to breed, it's a uh, hop, skip, and away. Right, is that right? Hop, skip, and away? Hop, skip, and a jump. Jump, away. Yeah. We have to jump. <laughs> we have the bloomer series here that we have to put a cover because they are, they're jumping. And then pinstripe. Spotted. Spotted. No. Spotted stripe. Where, pin, do, you, where do you see a stripe? Oh, I don't know. <laughs> well, they do have the pinstripe and then they have no, a spot. So, okay, right. so we'll spotted dumba. What are these guys called? Though? The Burmese clouded pearl. Those, those are the Kobutai, Kobutai no, loach, the Botias. Okay. And a couple of the marble, uh, uh, clouded Burmese archer. Okay. So not a huge shipping, but we did have a lot of stingrays, and that's why we this was the really the second part of the other shipment from last week. It was just too many boxes that we couldn't handle it all at once. Okay. So. You guys got to see it. We'll probably do an unboxing video. Unboxing video. We'll probably do a stock video pretty soon so you can see everything we have in stock. We just have to take individual pictures of all these and sex them as well. Good job. You said you were going to do it. I said I'll do the albinos. Okay, so it's on you. See you guys next time. <laughs>